here often is a drive to get more business to the private sector in this body. But generally, the argument has been that somehow that'll save money. And in this case, it's been more than proven that that's not true. Uh, in the vast majority of times, when we've contracted out, we have wasted taxpayer dollars. So if you are truly a fiscal conservative, or if you just care about wasting money, period, you should care about having a cost-benefit analysis, which sometimes shows it's more costly to go to the private sector, and sometimes it's more costly to be done by state workers. This isn't a Democratic, Republican thing. This is a do you want to waste taxpayer money or not sort of issue. Well, right now, we're in the middle of a debate about government smart or stupid. And this is not smart government. This is stupid. It is stupid to spend additional money for the same work at a higher rate. Then decide, you know, are we more efficient, more efficient subcontracting some of this work out? Are we more efficient using state engineers? Nobody's got a beef with the state engineers. DOT is hiring a hundred of them in the last six to eight months here. The reason the Democrats are choosing this bill to make a hot potato out of because they think we're trying to go after the DOT state engineers, and we're not. We simply want to work with good data. That's why I don't speak a lot on the floor. How can you, how can you speak to something that's just blatantly false? I'm not going to waste everybody's time. If so, the clerk will close the roll. There are 54 ayes, 39 nays. Assembly Bill 522 is passed. Gentlemen.